Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Tours to Tony here. Today's video, I'm bringing you five tips on how to get better at jets. Um, first things first with jets, if you're just coming from props to jets, they're totally different worlds, especially as you progress through jets. A lot of the tactics and ways you fight or fought with props do not transfer over to jets. Have you ever been flying in your jet, having the time of your life? You just got maybe one or two kills, and then all of a sudden your jet explodes? Well, this first tip's for you. The first tip of this video is going to be paying attention to your surroundings and minimap. Uh, the first part of that, uh, paying attention to your surroundings, you always want to have your head on, a, head on a swivel with jets, more so than you ever did with props or even early jets, because everything has a long-range missile, and just it's point click adventure at this point boys anybody with two like two neurons that are firing they see you they're gonna launch a missile at you i do it too and paying attention to the mini map in this clip you just seen i was about to launch a missile at that f5 i looked at my mini map and saw two scary red dots and i decided to look behind me luckily when i looked behind i saw an aim 9 l that was about to hit me Luckily, the AIM-9L was trash, and I was able to one-flare it with full afterburn. All right, guys, tip number two is going to be never be the first guy into the fight. Uh, I know this sounds this kind of, sounds kind of wussy, or you're baiting your teammates, but yeah, fuck yeah, I, I am. They're probably going to steal your kill anyways. So never be that first guy, and my reasoning behind it is when two sides are meeting in the, in the beginning of the match, <clears throat> that's when everybody has their radars on and that's when the overpowered missiles are going to be used basically you're just gonna you're kind of counting cards you're just gonna let them launch as many missiles as they can at your teammates bait them dumb bastards and then move in for the kill on people that are slow or not paying attention Man, I used to have such a hard time with jets until I started using these rat tactics on people and my god does it pay off Tip number three, guys, is going to be knowing your jet's role. Uh, mainly if you're flying jets, you're going to be in a fighter, and I think there's two roles for fighter jets. Uh, there's going to be the pure dogfighter. Uh, a couple examples of that is going to be your F5Cs, your J35s, MiG-21s, and then you're going to have your missile platforms, which are your F4s, your F15s, uh, the MiG-23s, Things that are designed just to have a fuck ton of missiles on them and launch them from a distance and get out. Tip number four is going to be notching missiles and flaring. Alright guys, so notching missiles. What I mean by notching missiles is most gents will have this RWR right here. So, this RWR, how do you use it to notch a missile? Well, long story short, is you want that radar signal to be coming in at either 3 o'clock or 9 o'clock on your jet. Uh, you will be flying parallel with the enemy jet, and this is problematic for a lot of them, especially F4s with the pulse Doppler. You might be able to get the radar lock quick enough or just at the right time to make the missile go dumb and lose lock. Um, if it's a MiG-29, you're just you're just fucking dead. You gotta try to drain that missile's energy. Have fun. You're probably dead. That thing has two guaranteed heat sticks, but that's for another uh, video. All right, guys. The final tip, tip number five for this video is stay the fuck away from 8.7, 9.7. Um, the jets you get from grinding through the trees are not that good compared to what people can buy, and Everybody that had 60 bucks, whatever the hell it is, has an SU-25 or an A-10. And unless you want to get frontal locked in a jet that doesn't have flares, you have a name 9B, you're just kind of... You, you're basically bringing a knife to a fucking gunfight and you're about to lose. Stay away from these BRs unless you own this, this, or this, or possibly this.